particular video, we will discuss about clinical relevance of axillary nerve. In this, we will see its mode of injury, various signs and symptoms, and affected motor and sensory functions. So, let's get started. Axillary nerve injury commonly occurs in dislocation of shoulder, either anterior or inferior, in fracture of surgical neck of humerus, and even during forceful abduction movement. Let's see what all signs and symptoms will be there. There will be pain over area of deltoid and loss of sensation over inferior portion of deltoid, which is known as regimental wedge area. There will be a weakness of movement, mainly abduction and external rotation, and rounded appearance of shoulder will be lost due to atrophy of deltoid muscle and shoulder become flattened. In affected motor function, there will be weakness of abduction and lateral rotation of shoulder due to involvement of deltoid and teres minor muscle. In long standing cases, there will be atrophy of deltoid muscle. In this particular picture, we can see there is the atrophy of deltoid muscle due to which the shoulder has lost its rounded appearance and become flattened. In affected sensory functions, there will be loss of sensation over inferior portion of deltoid due to affected upper lateral cutaneous nerve of arm. This is the portion anteriorly over which there will be loss of sensation and this is posteriorly. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and keep learning.